Hello, today I am showing you how to run course builder application on Ubuntu Linux operating system. I installed Ubuntu 11.4 version. Let's check from the course builder website for the installing instruction. Here it says first download and install Python. So let's check that our system installed Python or not. Go to the terminal window, terminal window, and write which Python command and enter. If Python is installed, then it will show installed path. In our case, Python is installed user slash bin slash python directory but if python is not installed then we have to install so for let's clear our command window so in order to install python we write sudo apt get install python and hit the enter button it will automatically install python in your system but we have already have python so we will not do this part you can do it in on your own second thing is download the google app engine click on this link google app engine click on this link to show you this window from this window choose the latest version which is 1.5.1 Choose this latest version for Linux operating system and click on this link to show you this window. Click the download link. Here it shows one pop-up confirmation window but we click OK button it will download the source code here. While downloading this source code uh, app engine, let's check third step. Third step is download the course builder simple application source code source files. Click on the link, it will show you this window. From here, we download the zip file. Zip file. Click on this link, it will show you this window. From here again, select the latest version. Select the latest version. And also download this zip, this zip file. So total two files are we are downloading. One is Google App Engine installed. One is Course Builder simple application. It seems my downloads will take some amount of time. So let's assume we. Are we downloaded this file. Extract those downloaded files on your desktop separately. In my desktop, I have Course Builder folder and Google App Engine folder. Course Builder folder and Google App Engine folder. Let's run Course Builder on Google App Engine server. So open the terminal window. In our case, all two files are located on desktop, so we have to move to desktop. Write cd desktop slash slash enter. Now write the running command which is google underscore app engine which is our google app engine folder name here it is and open this open this window uh, folder here we have div underscore app server dot pi file this file is used to start google app engine server so we have to write in the terminal window div underscore app server dot pi 
space course builder folder name course builder folder name is course builder so we write course builder and hit the enter button first is checking all the updates and now it's starting the google app engine server if if there is a no error then it will it it the window will look like this if there is an error error message will be displayed over this terminal window so we don't have we seems don't have any error so let's check open the browser window and then write localhost 8080 and hit the enter because our course builder software is running in this port it will display if it's displaying this window then course builder is running successfully this is the all steps that we have to follow in order to run course builder in on ubuntu linux thank you so much